In this video, we're going to learn about IRR, or internal rate of return, and how to use the function available in Excel to make that calculation simple and quick. So we have an investment appraisal in front of us where a project is going to return certain values over certain years. Now we use this in one of our other videos for calculating NPV, but in this tutorial, we're going to calculate IRR. Now the IRR, what does that mean? Well, it means what rate would my discount rate or the rate used in my investment appraisal need to be to give me an NPV of zero. In other words, how much interest would I have to earn on my capital for this not to be a worthwhile project? The higher the rate, the better, because the higher the rate, that means the more this project is returning for you. So it's a very simple function to use. The only complex bit is understanding what IRR actually is. So let's get the function in and compare a few figures. So if you go equals IRR open bracket and then highlight the values in order of how they appear. So in the first year, we're spending 8,914 and up until the last year, we're getting back 12,854. So I've just highlighted that range. That's all I've done. I'm going to fix it with a few dollar signs and I'm going to close that bracket. Enter. So what is this telling me? Well, it's saying that the cost of capital, or in this case, the discount rate would need to be 21.19% in order for this not to be a worthwhile project. So let's see what happens if in this rate, which is calculating my NPV, would were to be 21.19%. Well, you can see that the NPV is nearly zero. So the IRR formula here is working. If this isn't making much sense or you need some more support, download this workbook with the link provided along with this video. But for now, it's important to understand that the higher this rate, probably the more worthwhile it is to do this project. However, the best measure for investment appraisal using the two formulas NPV and IRR still holds true to be NPV. However, the IRR formula is also quite quick and simple to use. See you in the next video.